let's get this going here. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to some more Terraria Calamity mod. I am Matt from Marion Gaming. So off camera, I did do a little bit of farming, some bows farming, and then some reforging over here. Uh, yeah, didn't do a, a whole lot of reforging because this stuff is expensive for some of them. And uh, let's see what time is it? Is it night time? It's night time. Let's go ahead and farm ourselves some of that Eye of Cthulhu. Make some money that way. And then we'll kind of just go from there. Alright. We got... We got the equipment we need, so that's all good. Take one of those. make ourselves this nice crimson blue ow whoops I done messed that up all right well it's daytime forget that there it goes there goes a waste <coughs> fair enough all right what we want to do though is there are some other bosses we have to fight. We need some of these. Like bosses that we're ready to fight, or should be ready to fight anyways. Let's see how we make this. Alright, Desert Medallion and the Desert Sand Stirs. So we need some Sand Block, Storm Lion, Mandible, and Cactus. So we need that. 15 sandbox. Where do we make it though? Just double check that. Anvil. Okay. Fair enough. So we need to go find ourselves a, uh, a storm lion and get the mandible. Let's change this. This change you for you. Okay. Very nice. Let's go down and kick some butt. Okay. You are not who we were looking for. I don't even know if I've seen a storm line yet. I kind of have an idea what they look like. Kind of like those ant lions but blue. We just have to get lucky enough to find one of those. Swarmer, hardened sand block. I don't think we need any of those. Go away. Um, hmm. Come here. Come back here, fool. Try to run away from me. There's an ant lion. 
Antelon. I don't know how you pronounce it. Ooh, that's a fossil. Mine this up. I didn't notice that this was different before. Probably is gonna help us get some more amber if we need it. Maybe some other new stuff. Especially with this calamity mod is that. What the heck was that? shards, seashells, oh, all the stuff to make those big tide bars. Oh, well, that's an easy way to do that. And he gave us a gold too. Man, let's get more of those spawning in. sand to the world. Mandible bow. 16 range damage. That's not bad. There's not a whole lot of this here. But, anyways. I just finished getting help. Someone else spraying water. Come right down for me, I dare ya. Or up. Wherever you're at. Just come towards me. Hmm. That's where we got our uh, sun zone. Some more of those heart crystals, life crystals. I don't know why I say heart crystals. That's just gosh darn time. Alright, what you got? You got freebies. That's what you got. Sell that later. For a little chunk of money. You didn't 
dropped one. Oh, that jerk. Man, that was gonna be my ticket. I just know that the boss that this was summoned, that's a desert theme, it's supposed to be a worm-ish type like the Eater of Worlds, and uh, should be able to kill him. Water spring, little mini boss, Sidrion, whatever that was. No? Okay. Alright, in that case, let's see here. We don't have cactus. Just realize that. Alright, with these Victide bars, however, what can we make? Probably something we've already passed. Fear of the storm does not consume ammo. Oh, Aerolog bars, we don't have those. A boomerang. That is material. Why is there two of the same? Oh, one's throwing damage, one's melee damage. Let's see. Oh, a cow. Launches sharks because sharks are awesome. And all this stuff, stuff you can't get yet. Coral spout. Cast coral water spouts that lay on the ground and damage water or er, damage enemies. Okay. Take just two of those and five coral. Um Great Bay Pickaxe. Ours is past that. Let's see, and then as for armor, I think this stuff lets you go in water freely if you have a full set. Shield of the Ocean. Increased defense by 5 when submerged in liquid and its material. Okay. So, can't do much with this stuff right now. Tractinator, sell the climbing claws. But speaking of that, oh no, we can't make the other tiger claws together. Okay, so we need to go get ourselves some cactus real quick. Which, if we're moving quick. This one right here. Do we not have a regular axe? We don't. Because we made the one and we decided to put it away. Weapons. Okay, now we have an axe. I don't know if 
you can only fight this boss at a certain time. And we'll try to fight it during the day. Again, our uh, equipment will work a little bit more in our favor. We can fight him during the day. Actually, while we still have this one, let's see what else it makes. Just this one, too. Alright, where is this desert medallion? Do I not have enough stuff? I could have swore I did. 15 sand blocks. Ugh. Uh, let's see, we might have some sand actually laying in here. Okay, now, let's make this stupid thing. Boom shakalaka. did much more damage than everything else. Had to keep that in mind. Otherwise, uh, we did it. The Desert Scourge. And I learned that these little things are just like little lore pieces, I guess. Great sea worm appears to have survived the extreme heat and has even adapted to it. What used to be a majestic beast swimming through the water has now become a dried up and gluttonous husk on a constant and voracious search for its next meal. Alrighty. I'll just put you down here. Alright, holy cow, we got a whole bunch of stuff. Storm spray fires a spray of water that drips extra trails of water. Does it scorch a mask? I don't really care about that. It has no value. I'm just gonna sell it anyways. Weather radio displays the weather. Okay. I'm not too concerned about the dang weather. I know that's. And equipment though, you can make the super cell phone that'll display everything. Damage aquatic discharge. Enemies release electric sparks on death. And let's see how that ours currently is better, but oh the little short sword. Not material though, so worthless. Starfish, we hold on to that. Let's see. Put 
Those way, those way, those away. Alright, broken or brisk ocean crest. Most ocean enemies become friendly and provides water breathing. Okay. So we'd use that over in the ocean, obviously. And arrow stone. Material, one of the ancient relics, increases movement speed by 10%, jump speed by 200%, and all damage and crit chance by 2%. Right. And what does that make? Heart of the element. Holy shnikes. Six defense, the heart of the world, increases max life by 20, life regen by 2, and all damage and crit chance by 5%. Increases movement speed by 10%, jump speed by 200%, increases damage reduction by 5%, increases max mana by 50, and reduces max mana usage by 5%. You grow flowers on the grass beneath you, chance to grow very random, die plants, and on grassless dirt. Summons all waifus to protect you, and toggling the visibility of this accessory also toggles the waifus on and off. Okay. Right. Damage by 2%. That's not bad though. However, no. Put that down here. This will hold on to, however. And that's this. Oh, look at that. Neat. And we did get some money. Alright, I do however want to attempt the um, Skeletron again. I don't, I know we don't have like maxed out super insane amounts of health, but I want to give it a shot. And if we fail, then we fail. And off camera I did set up a little, a little dungeon defender event, a little spot for that. gonna need to explore the jungle some more try to find an anklet of wind so we can combine that with aglet and these boots and start working towards some super boots Federico, I appreciate it. Alright, let's get ourselves one more little campfire set up. Let's put it... Right there. Okay.
There we go. And then just wait for it to hit nighttime. Probably just take one of these and see if what else these books can make now. See if they can make anything different. Don't you dare become a blood moon. Alright. Need you back on. You back on. I almost feel like we should put on the, the horses, but at the same time, not really. Try it that way. Why I went all the way up to him, I don't know. Let's fight ourselves the Eye of Cthulhu a couple times. Make some money that way. Dang it. That's it. Thank you. 
that one now, now that we beat them. That is nice to be able to just buy them. Once you beat them.
Yeah, I was gonna get those stars, but I don't need to. We're maxed out on basic mana. Alright, book, what can we make with you? Bunch of pianos. Bookcases. Nothing else. Pick up the other teardrop cleaver real quick. And then let's see where we're at for money now. Sell you, sell you. Seven. Did we kill seven of them? We had seven bags? Or did we just get lucky and some of them drop twice? without selling all the ore. Which, speaking of that, let's see here, how many ore does it take to make a bar? Some of these, whoops, some of these ores for some reason sell more if you sell them by the ore as opposed to by, you know, making the bars first. So let's see here, three ores make one bar. early game like this. And then we do it that way, just so we have a spot to put the bars. Quick stack, what have you. Nice. Now we buy our mini shark. Okay, that's fine. Ruthless, that's fine with that. Large. I'm just curious on that one. Holy cow, that thing is huge. I just think there's much bigger later. Okay. 
agile. It's fine. What can we do for you? Fair enough. And you? More damage. Critical strike. Fair enough. This is turning out pretty good. That's fine. As long as it's something of plus four. needing though is ammunition. Let's put... We need another chest for fishing items. related in here as well. So like our bait. Doesn't need to be up there. And any fish we eventually catch. Alright, as for the rest of this. We gotta remember we will need to buy ammo later on. What did I just get five of? It just said five. Didn't tell me what I picked up though. Hmm. But in the jungle, we want to try to find an anklet of wind. And some more life crystals. Some way to make money too. Selling all that meteorite. Which actually, speaking of that, we're gonna want all of that for. Um, Whatchamacallit? Meteor bullets. That should be enough. Okay. Should be good enough. I 
even if it's not good enough, I'm just gonna go back to the more than you're right as well. Oh yeah, duh. We have our, uh, our stuff on. Staff of Rigo. Creates grass and moss on dirt and sound. Increases alchemy plant collection when used together.
because it makes melee weapons have a little bit of armor penetration. And blah blah blah. blah. Sharpening station. Need that to make the blade of grass later on. And work towards this nice super sword. We are able to make one thanks to the Calamity mod, but to do so we need some... Uh, we need pink job. Which we have not found any of quite yet. Drop 
some of that sludge. I don't know how much of that stuff we'll need later on down the line. Small blocks, I can only put them in that way quickly. Marble bow. Got a metal detector. Hoo ha. Material. Fair enough, I guess. Oops. I didn't mean to use all my buffs. 
forgot that I have had gravity potion. Living do. 10% increased damage reduction, plus 5 defense, and increased life regen while in the jungle. And that's material. Jeepers. Bone ash. What can we do with that? The archaic powder. Okay. And this, we would need the stopwatch and yes. Okay. Very nice. Fever, it's all that. Alright, bye. Kind of like this. I'm making that money. Potion materials. Airborne jungle abomination. XL canister, though. Blade of grass. Let's see. 
12 stingers, 12 spores. I can actually make that. It's right there. Caustic Edge. Give sick. It is material. Start working on preparing for Skeletron part two. So we have swiftness potion already. Don't want grab. Don't want grab potion. Um Archery we can take. I don't think it's gonna matter too much though. Of those because we'll make a regen and we'll make an iron skin. Where's it going? Okay. Now we'll make that. Regen. Iron skin. Just buy a bunch of unholy arrows, maybe. So we have them. A bunch of muscle pounds. And then. We'll make these into the right bars. And then we'll make. at extreme speeds. Hmm. So if you made like a little area, I guess, it would bounce around maybe? That might work. It's 
bit less damage. However. Hmm. I think we try this one. And then we'll set up a big box as well. So in that case, we need some more meteorite. if it works. Might or might not. We'll find out though. So now, what we'd want to do is get some blocks and we'll just set up like an arena. Honestly, the rest of the world is going to get a little bit closer Oh, 
We actually got pretty close. We actually probably couldn't beat that guy. We actually put on the proper equipment from the get-go. a little setup. We can uh, find a heart and data. I'm 
metal detector is pretty useful. Set up our little arena. Oh, 
So with having that island, uh, what's called an island, a demonite, um, that ain't, that's gotta be a clan. And I'm wondering then if my world happened to have corruption instead of crimson, I'd get a floating island of crimson?
little bit. damage.
One thing we can do is get this done. Hey, bunny, sell you for ten more gold. Thank you. All right, we'll do this goblin army, and then we'll do a. Uh, Defender event. I don't need to hold on to the detector anymore. I think it's from the last.
That's almost done. Then we'll do the dungeon of the dungeon of the dungeon of the dungeon of the Goblin archers are now defeated. Get that banner going, make this event even easier. Alright, so you, so one of you. Do this event real quick and call it episode. Call it an episode. We have our proper equipment on, we should do. Oh, 
Face them out a little bit.
that. Which is good. Because now we can use that against boss fights. explodes when enemies come near. Is this a once use thing or you're not considered an enemy. We could do. Place you and you. Okay. Over this way, we have our little glowing mushroom biome. There's another boss we should be able to do that is exclusive to the glowing mushroom biome. Hopefully this will make me do. We can find this boss normally, or if it's only through summoning him. I know the summoning him. Seed will want later. Um, with whatever I have if I need to go fetch more. To cap the uh, sprout. Summons the giant mushroom crab. Okay. shortly after. And any farming we need to do ah uh, wrong, wrong thing. Any farming we might need to do we'll do off camera. To prepare us. Like get some like hellstone or something. Maybe put an anklet of wind off the 
Okay, so we can we can do that though. We need to get some more glowing mushrooms. And then we could do it. Just thinking, just if we got a bag or something from the uh, from that dark made boss that we fought to the dungeon of the dungeon defender. I don't think we did. Couldn't, couldn't remember if it gives you one or not. I was thinking it was all special. No. Two more. The boss fight music that was pretty neat. And uh, made it feel like a boxing match. Alright, let's do this again. 
curious on how that fight went though. We have some notes. It was a boss that was meant to be fought earlier on. Crabulon. The crab and its mushrooms are a love story. It's interesting how creatures can adapt given certain circumstances. Okay. I'll open up the treasure bag back here. The mycelial claws and sick oh. a fungal clump to fight for you. The clump latches onto enemies and seals their life for you. to increase damage and critical effect chance. The shade rains down when you're hit. You will confuse nearby enemies when you are struck. Drops brimstone fireballs from the sky. Occasionally, brimstone fire rains down while invincibility is active. You need a lava and 50% increased damage while in lava. That was a bungle pump to fight for you. You leave behind poisonous seawater as you move. 75% increased movement speed to increase all damage and plus 40 defense while also merge in liquid. If you are damaged while submerging liquid, you will gain a damaged aura for a short time. Holy crap. Well, alrighty then. Why can I flip it? I wonder how much life this steals from it is. Alright. 
feral claws are gonna go. No longer need. I am curious to see how well this will do. So let's summon... Oh, we can summon that now. Or we can buy one, I should say. Not as quick as you might think. What's on the side? I'm forgetting we have that stone saddle. We get to sell back. I think actually almost funny it was more profitable.
instead of having that, why don't we shall... Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Bye.